Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm sharing with you what modeling agencies are looking for on Instagram. Okay guys, here I am, Allie with NGM Modeling, uh, and let's hop right into these tips. One of the very first things that we look for is actually going to be a part of your bio, and that is something that tells me that you are a model. So we want to have that in your bio. It's one of the very first things that we have access to when we go to your page. So make sure you have in, in there that you are a model or you're looking for collabs, different things like that. So make sure it's stated in there somehow that when we go there, that's one of those things that we're going to see in your bio. The next, next thing we're looking for is we're looking for a variety of photos. And one of those things that we're looking for is photos of you smiling and not smiling. Oftentimes we go to people's Instagram and you're wondering, you're like, well, I wonder what her teeth might look like. We have no idea because um, there are no pictures of this person smiling. So make sure that you include some pictures of yourself on your Instagram smiling and not smiling. The other thing you need to include is pictures of full body, all right? So just so that we know there's not something that you're hiding or you're hiding, uh, you know, either your size or your height, there's nothing to be afraid of. Just be confident and um, make sure that you're sharing pictures, not just of your face or just headshots, um, but just some nice uh, looking uh, full body shots. The other thing that we're looking for is a professional presence. So we want someone who is uh, a model and wants to be a model and looks like they want to be a model. So that's how your account should look. Um, make sure that you've cleaned that up and that you've made it look good. Another thing is if you mention that you've done photo shoots and there's no evidence of that, in your Instagram. Sometimes <laughs> models will go in and they'll delete pictures from photo shoots and projects that they've done with people. And um, that's actually a huge uh, turnoff for uh, those looking at uh, your Instagram is, oh, well, they're just gonna promo it for a day or two and then they're just gonna delete it off of their Instagram. So once you've done a project, leave the stuff on there because this is great for us knowing, hey, this person not only goes and does the work, is showing us the work, but then they also are a benefit to the work after the work is done. Guys, I hope this video has helped you guys out. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like this video, leave me a comment down below, and I'll catch you on my next video.